Hi, in this video, I will tell you how to schedule a customer appointment against the customer invoice. <clears throat> you can see that this is basically the customer invoice. The status of this invoice is completed. After completion of the invoice of the customer, you can go to right side, dotted icon, and open add bulk schedule. When you click on a bulk schedule, one, two, three, and four customer follow-up schedules are uh, filled with the respective field 10 days, three months, and three months, and further three months. With the, the start time, uh, start date and time, and end date of time, and then the next schedule date and time, then next, and the next, uh, with respect to uh, with respect to the duration, 10, three months, and three months. You can assign any a person to this schedule, and you can add any node here. The status of these schedules are initially pending. After the uh, verification of these schedules, uh, the most important thing is the start date and time. Then you can press load schedule. After loading schedule, the uh, confirmation pop-up appears. You can press yes button. The uh, successfully customer schedule is created. You can also update this schedule by clicking add bulk schedule. The previous uh, schedule is loaded in the system. In the pop-up, you can update and then you can uh, load the schedule. And uh, you can further add a schedule in, in a pop-up. You can uh, link with this schedule with the bulk schedule by adding a schedule here in a box. In this way, you can add the schedule against the customer. Uh, you can go to main listing page where you can view the schedule. When you on the summary page on the top of right side, you can open the schedule and click on view schedule. You can search the customer. You can see that this customer, you can click on the schedule. You can see that 29th of August, this time the first schedule appointment and the second appointment, third and fourth appointment. You can click load more to view the schedule detail. Okay, you can see that the notice appear here. Now you can mark the schedule, done. You can add any feedback here and you can rate any value. For example, I'm rating this one and pressing yes button. You can see that the schedule is done and with rating and the feedback remarks. You can uh, mark similarly with other appointment and schedules. You can see that this one is pending. You can mark as cancel. rating and then you can add. if any cancel schedule you can uh, click on the pencil icon to create a new schedule if any schedule is cancelled then you can uh, press pencil icon to open a new schedule pop up and uh, adding a uh, new schedule in this Press save button. The schedule is added. Now you can press search schedule or view schedule inside the customer. Click on the customer schedule. You can see that. The new schedule is added here. Okay. In this way, you can add the schedule by clicking the, uh, the invoice and open the add bulk schedule you can view the schedule by clicking view schedule inside the customer name and open the schedule detail against the customer and you can mark the status of the schedules and appointments and also you can view today's schedules by clicking today yesterday and tomorrow you can see that Today's schedule is here. You can mark 
as done and set the rating if you want then you can press save button you can see that the schedule is added here and with the status of done thank you in this way you can add the schedule and view the schedule and mark the status thank you